YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. What's going on, everybody? I'm Johnny Valdez, as you already know, and welcome to the channel. Initially, this first video was going to be an in-depth explanation of how I lost the weight over these last few years. But, as I've tried recording this four times, the more and more I watch it, I just feel like I'm just blabbing and blabbing and blabbing. And those videos turn out to be like 15 minutes long. I don't want to take up too much of your time yet, as the future videos will be covering my past and current journey, as I aim to help those people of all age and sizes build the best version of themselves. I'm making these videos because I'm aiming to be the person that I didn't have while going through my journey. I'm not claiming to be an expert or that I know everything, not one bit. I'm just a firm believer that hard work and consistency will bring you the right results that you deserve. I used to spend hours upon hours on YouTube and the internet just hoping to find someone or something that was a story that related to me and my current situation. Growing up, I always struggled with my weight as I was the chubbier kid in the group and I never really had too much self-confidence. Over the last three years, I've been working non-stop every day to try and better myself and lose weight and build a person that I could be proud of while looking in the mirror. I started at 270 pounds with over 40% body fat and I managed to make it down to 150 pounds with just under 10% body fat as I stepped on stage for my first time in a bodybuilding show at the Summer Shredding Classic where I took home top five in the men's transformation category. I aim to not stop competing in the future as I've learned that's something that I really enjoy doing. As I grew up wrestling and playing football, those type of sports always seem to push me to the next level and with competing in bodybuilding like that, it's something that I genuinely enjoy. So future videos are gonna have a ton of documentation of that journey and things with that as I get further into those. My weight loss journey probably started off pretty similar to many of those looking to start one of their own. I didn't have it all mapped out, I didn't know exactly what I was going to do, but I was in a situation that I wasn't proud of and I was well aware that something needed to change and I needed to do something. I showed up every day whether it was in the kitchen or in the gym, I aimed to make better decisions and as time went on I learned more and more as I can applied more interest. So I know what it's like to get knocked down time and time again and feel like you've ran out of options and have no choice but giving up. So I wanna be here to let you know that you're more than capable of achieving those goals and I'm here to show you that it's worth it to keep pushing forward. Because over these last couple years, not only has this been a weight loss journey, a journey where I've been trying to lose weight and things like that but there was a person that i wasn't proud of when i was looking in the mirror and i really wanted to fix that so it's been a mental journey as well i was in a position where i was depressed i was not happy with myself and just so many other things so many worse things to sum it up basically i don't think i'd be looking at you right now if i didn't make a change and i didn't fix myself it's funny because I already know this video is going to have jump cut after jump cut after jump cut and it's going to be completely stitched together and I really wanted it to be perfect as I was making my first YouTube video but I remembered it's my first video and it doesn't need to be perfect. I'm going to get better with everything and that kind of brings me into my next point as I get close to kind of wrapping this video up. I want to leave you with a couple things to take from this. So three things that were just kind of the most significant to me while losing weight. Build that momentum. Start slow. You don't need to go 110% into any diet or anything like that. You can start at 50 and build that momentum up. Aim to make it at 100%. But starting at 100% for me was the reason why I failed so many times at my diets in the past. I would go so hard for two weeks and the first time I made a mistake, the whole thing was over with. So go slow, go steady, do it diligently and try to just do it as carefully as possible because you don't need to be perfect, which is the next point, is strive for consistency. Don't strive for perfection. I can't tell you how many times I've gained weight over these last few years but it's not about 
always being perfect. It's about getting knocked down and getting back up time and time again. Gaining the weight, knowing you're gonna lose that again because you are in control. At the end of the day, whether you're winning or you're losing, you steer your ship and you're in control. So my third and final tip that I could leave with you for today is it's a majority of the decisions that you make in the kitchen, not the workouts you decide to do in the gym. That means two different things. You've probably heard people tell you it's 70% diet, 30% workouts, or however they want to break that down. That's true because it's also the same saying as abs are made in the kitchen, not in the gym. Your diet, your health is what's gonna skew that number on the scale way more than those killer workouts. So the second part of that is it doesn't matter how you get out there, what you do when you're out there, just get up and get out there and get moving. It doesn't have to be the craziest, most textbook workouts that you see in the gym. You can make it enjoyable. You can just be happy because that's the goal ultimately is to do what you wanna do and be happy while doing it. So don't strive for perfection, strive for consistency, start small, build your momentum and enjoy the process because most of it is made in the kitchen, not killing yourself in the gym. That just comes with it. Now that you know me, I'm more than excited to meet all of you as we get started on this journey and building the best version of ourselves. So keep your head up, stay resilient, and enjoy the process. I'm Johnny Valdez, and welcome to the Fit Family. This is gonna feel pretty cool saying, so comment, like, and I know you're new, so subscribe, and be sure to turn on post notifications so you never miss a beat. Deuces.